Hey guys, so I got my Lumi keyboard here and we're gonna play around with some of the different sounds that are included when you buy the keyboard. So you get Ruli Studio Player um, included when you purchase the keyboard. I'm pretty sure uh, it's if you get the studio version or like the Play Lumi version, you have access to this. And we're just gonna play around with some of the different sounds here. So this is, this is the guitar overdrive lead. Um, and the thing that's cool about the Lumi is you have a pressure sensitivity. So if I hit lightly, sounds like this. If I press down, kind of gives um, this feedback effect. And if you enable this um, pitch bend uh, feature right here, you can actually wiggle So there's all these different instruments that were created using their equator synthesizer. Um, so this isn't actually in equator. These are like instruments that were created in equator. Um, which is fine for me because I'm kind of a noob with all of this. So um, it's fun to just play around with the different um, instruments that are kind of presets. It's got like a coral aspect to it it's like strings and then it kind of fades into like a chorus now there's certain instruments where i feel like you don't really want the pitch bend oh here's a flute this i want the pitch bend So the pressure is kind of like more air, like if you're playing the flute. It's sensitive, it's very sensitive. Actually, I don't know if I want the pitch bend. You can kind of like control like a vibrato with it. It's kind of cool. And you can drop octaves with this button right here. Let's try pitch bend. Yikes. It's cool for like sound effects and stuff. Creep show. Oh, yeah. Can't tell. It's weird. It's so interesting how some keys react differently. It's, there's like so much going on. It's crazy. 
dark mass base. key and it's doing all of this I wonder what happens if you do so like you, this has a, an arpeggiator built in so this is probably yeah this isn't really a good instrument for the arpeggiator I'll show you that later dirt organ One thing that's weird is like the pressure. If you do full pressure on the attack, it actually like doesn't reg register as pressure. It's like the attack is treated separately from pressure. You have to kind of almost like let go and then press it again. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Drama brass. Oh, this one's really cool. So. So it's like, it's got this brass attack, but like if you press it lightly, it's like very soft. And then pressure makes the, the strings louder. It's super sensitive sometimes. That's cool. DX bell. This might be cool with the arpeggiator. So there's all sorts of different settings. And you can play around with this. Final Frontier. I turn off the arpeggiator. That's awesome. Wow. What? That's one note. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. I just pressed one note and it's like doing all of this crazy stuff. So cool. Ocean's Lament. That's... Oh, that is so cool. Oh my gosh. These instruments are so dynamic. Oh my gosh. So one thing I noticed too is like on the... Where it says... Um, like the, the little info down here, it'll say slide, slide up to add vibrato to the vocal. And I think that's referring to um, if you get the Seaboard. 
So Rolly makes a seaboard that has a lot more control um, than just the Lumi. So the Lumi, like I said, you have pressure and you have the wiggle back and forth. But like if you move your fingers up and down, that's something the seaboard has. It has, it can sense like where on the key you're pressing. And so it gives you another parameter that you can control with the instrument. And the seaboard also lets you kind of slide under keys and and go up um, to kind of morph between notes. So you don't really get to do that with the Lumi either. Wow, 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 wow. String and horns. Cool. Slide into wobble. Oh, that's cool. This is like the opposite. So like the more pressure you put, it kind of like goes out. So it's like really strong at first. And then you press more. That's awesome. That's a nice simple one there. The mothership. Drop it down. So cool. The Stranger. This is awesome for like sound effects. Mm. All right, guys. So <laughs> that's not all of the sounds. There's a ton of sounds here. Um, I don't know if I should go through every single one and do just like a little loop here, but, um, and that's, this is just the kind of basic equator library. There's, there's several other libraries that you can get, um, for free. So like if you click get more sounds, so there's all of these, um, sounds. So some of them you have to buy and some of them are included. So like motion dance, Evolving Classics, Hybrid Forms. These are all included. And then again, if you want to like create your own, you can buy Equator um, to like have full control. But that's like way over my head. I'm a total noob with this stuff. But yeah, I'm having a ton of fun with this thing. Uh, if you want to check out the Lumi, I got links in the description below. Um, and I'm going to do some more videos on this thing because it's super fun, super cool. Let me know if there's something specific you want to know about it. And that's going to do it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.